Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This channel, Avid Science, is all about trying to learn various concepts of science by practicing a lot of questions. In this video, we are going to solve this question on lead code regarding second highest salary part 2. The difficulty level of this question is medium, and I'm going to share the SQL schema as well as the panda schema in the description box below. Okay, the question reads We are given a table called employees with three different columns employee ID, salary, and department. Employee ID being the unique key for this table. Each row of this table contains information about an employee, including their ID, salary, and department. We are asked to write a solution to find the employees who earn the second highest salary in each department. If multiple employees have the second highest salary, include all employees with that salary. Return the result table ordered by employee ID in ascending order. Let's go through this example. So here we have an employees table where we have several different employee IDs, their salaries and department. So if you look at department sales, so there are four different employees. Highest salary is 90,000. Second highest is 80,000 where two people have the same salary. So employee ID 2 and 3 have the second highest salary in sales. Similarly, if we look at IT, so the second highest salary is 55,000 employee ID 5 and so on and that is what we have in our output so to solve this question what we need to do is we need to partition by the department and try to rank the salary from highest to lowest let's try to do that so from this table called employees let us try to keep all the columns so select star and then let's perform a ranking now how should we perform the ranking here the question says if multiple employees have second highest salary include all the employees that means if there is a tie do not skip it and also ties should be assigned the same rank so we need to use dense rank in this condition so dense rank and then for every department since this is used so over partition by the department column and then order by the salary column in descending manner and let's alias this as rank let us go ahead and run this let's see what do we get in our output if i drag this above this is what we have so we have for every department what is the rank one rank two and so on based on the salary now what we need is we only need to keep those rows where rank is equal to two because that is what we need in our output second highest salary so we can save this entire thing in a common table expression so with cte as this entire thing goes into parentheses and then from this common table expression we are only going to keep those rows where rank is equal to two and then what do we need in our output we need only two columns that is employee id and department so return us employee id and department and this should also be ordered by employee id in ascending order so order by employee id let me go ahead and run this let's see what do we get in our output so yeah this is accepted if we look at our output it is same as expected output let me go ahead and submit to see pass all the test cases so yeah, this is accepted and this is how we do it so not a difficult question what we had to basically do was firstly from this employees table we ranked based on the salary in descending order so that we have highest ranked salary second highest salary and so on once we had the ranking done using the dense rank function and why use dense rank we discussed about it and then we kept only those rows where rank equal to 2 because we need the second highest salary and we returned only the required columns and ordered by employee id in ascending order so this is how we do it let me know if there's a better or more efficient solution to solve this question let the solution be in the comment section below and i'll see you guys in the next video